Hey guys, the Obsidian Horse here, and today we are looking at how to build, sorry for the chops right there, Optifine, the A37 Dragonfly. It was the Cessna made it, it was the Cessna A37 Dragonfly, and it is a Vietnam era, like our Corsair video that should be coming out at the same time, reconnaissance plane based off the T37 Tweet, which is a trainer, and also a light bomber. It uh, was not carrier born, it was land based, had a crew of two, and really cool camouflage for this video. Some two engines mounted on the side, I'm sorry for the chops, it's optifine. Uh, cool wing section, and a nice camouflage. Gonna be a little bit tricky to build, but yeah, let's launch right into it. First, I have some tips for you. Build this two blocks under here, because you're gonna be needing to get underneath the aircraft a lot, to place different slab things, slab things. Uh, the wingspan is 21 blocks, the length is 17, so if you just chop down the wingspan a little bit, you could fit this in a hangar one plot for naval battle zone. Otherwise, it is a hangar two. Had some nice area for torpedoes under the wings and like some bombs in the cockpit. Some blocks you're gonna be needing is a trapdoor, nether brick slab, brown wool, pumpkin, glass, nether brick stairs, lever, stone brick stairs, stone brick slab, green wool, black wool, and a button. And texture pack will be in the description, will not be actually in the description below, I've been having some issues with it right lately, but we'll try to get it back up as soon as possible. So yeah, let's launch right into building it. So after you've cleared your area, you're going to get roughly to the middle of that area. Go, let's get our glass to do this easier, let me get rid of my world edit wand. Go. One block on the first block end, to one block above the ground, place on the lower hitbox two nether brick slabs. Behind that, we're going to place one brown wool, a brown wool to that side, going two back, and a green wool to the other side, going two back. So like so. Then we're going to place one slab in both those little areas and then one slab on the last blocks. On the second block in, you can put this as a random block, a uh, slab on top of it, then one glass behind that, and then one slab on either side of that first glass, so that's your cockpit should be looking like, and then next to that, two glass extending on either side. But first, we're going to cover this up again. Any block, I'm choosing green, a lever on each of those. We're going to get one of our slabs, place that under the middle of that block, and then extend it three to either side. And we're going to place actually our first landing gear. Let me just go look at the actual A37. So previously where this first slab was, that's not where it's supposed to go. It's supposed to go one block forward. And right there instead is supposed to be our black wall a nose gear with the button on either side. After you have that and you have your three slabs behind here, continue the three slabs again, this time with a stair behind each one. We're also, I forgot this block, we're going to need a hay bale. We're going to put this hay bale in the middle facing upward and behind that, I believe we just leave it blank. Yes we do. And now on top of this little section in the middle you can place two glass blocks with two slabs on top, so it should look like that from the front, from the side. And now, with that once we, there should be a way just to permanently turn weather off in your Minecraft world. There probably is, and I'm probably sounding really dumb to YouTube not knowing how to do it. So now that we have this slab here on this side next to that lever, we're going to place a grain wall, and on the other side next to the other lever, level lever lever going to place another green wool. Next to each of these we're going to place a pumpkin. Let's go up and wool so we can place a pumpkin next to either one of these. Now once you have your pumpkin placed on the blocks behind this, so you're going to put one slab going up like that, you're going to go one, two, three, four. Same on the other side, one, two, two, three, four. This is probably going to be one of my hardest builds that I'll do. 
this one. So if, you, if you're falling a little bit behind, it's a little bit tricky. Don't feel like you're doing so bad. Now with our trap door, we're going to place one going off of each of these slabs. And any block you want under those slabs. I'm just doing green wool. And this is why we cut out the bottom part. So we can do then slabs under those, just like basically exactly copying the top. And then trap door sticking out. Should be able to choose. So you should have created the tunnel, fill that in with any block you want. No one's going to see it. And then on this back one, this back block, you're going to place another pumpkin, ex uh, showing your exhaust. So now that you have both of those placed, on now we can start moving on to our wings. So on the one on the left is what we're going to be starting with. We're going to go four brown wool, three brown wool, two brown wool, one brown wool, creating a very simple pattern like so. Off of that, we're going to place one grain wool, slab, one grain wool, two grain wool, three grain wool. Now that you have that, you're going to place Looks like one more layer of green wool, another three, and then our five black wool going one off the front, one off the back. Grab our button for this part. Button on the front, button on the back, and then on the middle three blocks, slabs on the top and bottom. There, now it's daytime, and we can mimic this wing on the other side, but a different camouflage pattern. We're going to go four grain, four grain, we can place our one slab here now, and then we're going to go two green, one brown, three brown, three brown, and then we should have be adding one more block, and that's going to be two brown, one green, and then we can do our fuel tank of our three Black wool, button on the front, slabs going down, button on the back, slabs there. So that's what you should be wings should be looking like right now. We're actually moving along at a very fast pace, quicker than I expected. And now right behind this, we're going to go one block in, place three brown wool. And now on the other side, we're going to do the same exact thing, but with green wool. One block in, place three green wool. And now you can cover first, with, after our cockpit here, we're going to place one brown wall on that side. I'm assuming green wall on the other side, yes. One green wall on the other side. Then combine the middle middle by doing two brown wall. Surround everything that's not been covered up by slabs. And now on the bottom, these slabs can go all the way up, and then these slabs can end right there. So it should look like that. And once we have this here, we can go on this back one, three green wool, a stair, then on the top of that, brown wool, green wool, brown two brown wool wool, and stair? No, another brown wool. Then we can go stair, stair two slabs and then for our tail section like our horizontal stabilizers we're gonna go two two one and just for a side view of the tail two two one is what your tail should be looking like so if we stand at the front tails gonna look like that and now for our slabs going down the middle we're gonna have right here one block for that stair a slab and carry that all the way back to the front you are pr almost finished. You can continue that slab one more block. And now all we need is our wheel landing gear. So we're going to go is down here. And this one right here. So second to last. We're going to break both of those. Actually, I think we're just breaking the uh, what, uh, trap door. And we're going to replace it with black, brown, black wall and dot. So break the trap door, black wall, button. And that is actually it on how to build an A37 
Dragonfly, Vietnam War era, reconnaissance, and light bomber aircraft. Some other things you could add is under the wings here. It might look weird. You might have to lower these landing gear one more block down. You could add more fuel pods. The, the actual thing had these also, like more fuel pods under the wings, or these, I guess, in this case, would be bombs. The real thing had those, and you could just keep doing that, lower the landing gear one more block. Hope you all like this video. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel to see more uh, cool tutorial videos on how to build uh, historically accurate uh, aircraft, some new War Thunder videos will be coming out soon, some Naval Battle Zone videos, and more random just stuff coming out about Minecraft and games. See y'all later, and I'll catch you in the next one.